Pressure is mounting. Major publication is calling for Feinstein to tell the truth. By Amy Moreno for truthfeednews.com. The pressure is mounting for Senator Dianne Feinstein to reveal details on the Chinese spy she employed as a trusted staffer for over 20 years. The Washington Post is now calling on Feinstein to fess up to the truth and explain how this happened and what damage was done. From Breitbart, Senator Dianne Feinstein has yet to explain how a Chinese spy came to work for her for decades, including while she was chair of the U.S. Senate Select Committee on Intelligence. Washington Post columnist Marie Thiessen, uh, who has written a book about the CIA and often writes about foreign policy and national security and intelligence. In his latest comment, uh, column, uh, Thiessen writes, uh, imagine if it emerged that the Republican chairman of the House or Senate Intelligence Committee had a Russian spy working on their staff. Think it would cause a political firestorm? Well, this month we learned that Senator Dianne Feinstein had a Chinese spy on her staff who worked for her for about 20 years, was listed as an office director on payroll records and served as her driver when she was in San Francisco, all while reporting to China's Ministry of State Security through China's San Francisco consulate. The reaction of the mainstream media? Barely a peep. Feinstein acknowledged the infiltration but played down its significance. Five years ago, the FBI informed me it had concerns that an administrative member of my California staff potentially being sought out by the Chinese government to provide information, Feinstein, uh, Feinstein said in a statement, which means the breach took place while Feinstein was heading the Intelligence Committee. But Feinstein ins insisted he never had access to classified or sensitive information or legislative matters and was immediately fired. In other words, junior staffer, no policy role, no access to secrets, quickly fired, no big deal. But it is a big deal. How does she know what he had access to when he was there for two decades, right? And she was uh, on the uh, uh, Senate uh, Select uh, for the Intelligence, Senate Select Committee on Intelligence. Really? Does she look like a whippersnapper to you as if she, uh, she would know what, uh, what was going on? Maybe she's just like uh, Ruth Bader Ginsburg that falls asleep during a meeting, you know? Uh, listen, she profited off of it. She was selling secrets. Uh, and things. She, she made a bundle and uh, she did deals for them uh, because uh, her, her husband made so many millions of dollars, 300 million or something that we know of. I mean, come on, come on, these people, yeah, can you turn the tables and, and say some uh, Republican had, a, had even a Chinese uh, spy on their staff? You know, it would be in the media 24 seven, guarantee you. But you can tell uh, the hypocrisy of it all, you know? The Democrats get away with everything, and they play dirty, profit off of everybody else, and uh, no consequences whatsoever. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below, and again, thank you so much for watching.